we have. Notice it doesn't have a reed. It's made out of a material, metal called brass, and it uses a small cup mouthpiece. There's no reeds on this particular one. And you have your lips together and you train your lips to buzz to make a particular vibration. Because in music, there's always some sort of vibration in all types of music. For the reed players, it was the reed vibrating on the tip towards the end of the mouthpiece. For the brass player, on their particular size mouthpiece, it's their lips, tiny parts of their lips inside the mouthpiece, um, buzzing and vibrating to make a certain sound. So Aiden is going to stand up, and he is going to play for you a, uh, oh, that Aiden stop, sorry. Aiden stop. Why are you looking weird? I looked at you. So Aiden in his big for Steelers hat is going to play for you the trumpet. This is also another instrument we have in jazz band. Take it away, Aiden. <laughs> All right, we're on the back of the scale, that's a typical major scale we have before, but you play it in a certain kind of rhythm called a swing rhythm. Some of our pieces that we play, like that very first one, is called swing. It's a swing eighth note to where it's not real straight, it's kind of lazy, kind of sounding a laid back feel. Another high rise system we have is called the French horn. <laughs> this is uh, an instrument that's all coiled up into one. In fact, if I stand probably right about here, and I were like Superman, and I could uncoil and take all this apart, it would go from me all the way almost to that wall. But you can't really see that because it's all coiled up together. This is called a French horn, but it's actually not French. It's actually English. But they call it a French horn, but most of the time we just call it a horn. It uses a similar mouthpiece as the trumpet. Can y'all see that? But it's a little bit of a deeper cup. It's got a little bit of a deeper cup, and it's a little bit more like a cone shape inside. So they still use their lips to vibrate it, but it's a different feeling than, say, the trumpet because it is so deep. It uses valves like the trumpet does, but these are called rotary valves, and it also has a thump valve. So instead of just having three, like the trumpets do, it has four because we also add the fourth valve. This is also the only instrument where you take your hand, kind of like a karate chop, and you actually play it with the bell, the hand in the bell, and then the sound actually goes behind you. 